everyone and welcome to another Battle Report on the Road Dice. Today I am joined with Tom once again. Well, I'm not called Tom. No. I am Alphiris. Oh, a sign of things to come. And I'm Sir Crumpington, a sign of other things to come. But Tom's brought a weird list, Yet. so I think you can go through yours first. But before you do, wait Tom, I'm getting too excited. If you look in the description, there's a link to the Living Realms website. And there's a cheeky discount code, so use that and get yourself some money saved on some 40k goodies. But now, Tom, on with yep. the list. Right, sir. Or should I call you Alpharius, as he is now? It depends how it goes today. <laughs> <laughs> if you lose, I'm just Tom. But if exactly. I win, I'm Alpharius. <laughs> We're always winning when we part while. Part part politics. <laughs> well, so, you never know. But uh, today, so I've got a patrol of Nurgle Demons. Yes. Because I just want to run my great and clean one. He's so nice. Like, it took me about eight hours to paint him and I like... He looks I, so I good. I want to get the Alpha Legion painted because we did a poll a couple of weeks ago and Alpha Legion bet Nurgle Demons by they did. quite a lot. Yes. But I had about 400 points spare and instead of painting more Alpha Legion I thought I might as well just use the... the yeah. Nurgle just, Demons that I've got. Yeah, just Florida. slot them in. Yeah. Um, so the patrol detachment. So the great and clean one is the Warlord. So he has got the Bioblade and Doombell. Very nice. Um, and he's an exalted great and clean one. So we'll roll that on camera. Yeah. So I can either choose one out of six abilities to give to him. So it's a bit like Captain Commander for Custodies. Yeah. Or another relic or whatnot. Okay. Um, or I can roll... 2d6 randomly oh. and just get them random which i'm gonna do because it gives me a chance of getting two buffs that are good instead of getting one yeah, that you, i want that makes sense and we all love randomness again, yeah so. it's it's fun it's a dice game at the end of the day and it's a leave it up to the dice gods so the wall of trait that i give him is plague fly hive so mm -hmm. when you're within seven it's minus one to hit so it might come into play might Ooh. not but okay gives him a bit more survivability yeah then the relic is the Endless Gift, which is Big Papa Nurgle. So each phase, he heals a wound. Nice, I like it. Um, but that's only if he's lost a wound in that phase. Right, I get you. So yeah. basically, if, if you cast Smite on me, I get a You get a wound back, wound yeah. Back. It's alright. Yeah, it's not bad. And I've got the spell, which is Fleshly Abundance, so I can heal D3 lost wounds. So oh it's boy, gonna, it's gonna yeah, be he's tasty. gonna be. You can heal up to like four wounds a turn. Yeah, oh. turn, well, no, can, can be heal up to five wounds a turn because you've got uh, fight phase, you've got shooting phase, you have got oh, it's each it's phase. each turn, not battle round. Yeah, oh, so it's every single phase, so it could heal up to six wounds a turn. I thought it was battle round. I didn't realize it was yeah. turn. Oh, that's gross. I, I want him to survive for as long as possible. I feel like he's gonna. I'm going to struggle at Touchwood because you've seen me on the channel. Yeah. I like to lose models really fast. <laughs> so, who knows what's going to happen. Yeah, anything could happen. Then the other uh, spell is Shriveling Pox. So, uh, choose an enemy unit within 18 and it gives them minus one toughness. Oh, nice. So, we was going to play against Death Guard, so I thought S that's something I need, but against... Orcs, it's even better. Yeah, all your bolters will be wounding me on freeze. Yeah. Stuff like that, it's pretty good. Um, so that is the Cast Demons all done. Yes. So what I'll do is I'll move on to the Alpha Legion now, because this is the bulk of my force. Yeah. So I've, I've put this in the main 40k Facebook chat, because I'm not sure how it works. They've given me the go-ahead, so let us know in the chat if it's wrong. Yeah. But I can use CP to give one of my Alpha Legion characters a wall uh, a relic sorry okay so i'll start off with the sorcerer first which is in terminator armor very nice so he has got the lightning claw and the four staff and i've paid a cp to give him hydra's whale okay which is a relic and he's got um two psychic abilities so that's death hex and then i've got precedence and then i've got a sorcerer uh which is just a normal sorcerer so yeah it's not model, but I'll give him a combi melter. Yeah, it's fine. Just because of points, really. And then it's got Delightful Agonies. And then I'll give him Precedence again. 
So that's plus one to hit just in case one of them dies. Yeah, and because it's such a good yeah. um, psychic ability. Then moving on to the units, because this is a battalion, I should have said that first. Yeah. So I've got a squad of 30 cultists. So just presence on the board. Yeah. I've got a 2 CP strat, which is like yours, so I can take them off the battlefield. And bring them back if I don't yeah. get rid of them. Yeah, that's um, fair enough. So because I've brought a full 30 man squad, it's going to be hard to move them off. Yeah, it is. And then I've got a um, two squads of care space marines. So uh, it's not WYSIWYG. I've instead of the auto cannon. Yeah. It's going to be the Reaper chain cannon. Yeah. Good uh, against so Ox. They both got that one. And then uh, one of them has got a plasma pistol and a fist. Yeah. And the other one has got a. I think it's plasma pistol and a axe as well. Okay. I don't think they'll probably survive into combat, but you know. Well, we'll have to see because it, it's arc shooting, so yeah. it's arc shooting. It's weird because yeah, it either goes really, really well, or yeah. you just don't hit anything. Well, it's, it is you rolling sixes. So. Who knows? <laughs> and then I've got Hellbrute, which has got Marcus and Nash there. I think that might be two or three CP. It means that you can fire twice. Yeah. Yeah, uh, the endless like cacophony, in it? Yeah, yeah, that's them. So he's got a missile launcher and twin lads cannon. Nice. So I'll just stay it back at the field and just launch Firebase, yeah, works. Yeah. And then I've got a squad of seven Terminators. Ooh. So they've all got Chain Fists and Combi Cosmos. Nice. Um, so Very that, nice. that'll be quite cool. <laughs> that is pretty tasty. Moving on to the fast attacks, I've got two units of Raptors. I love Raptors. Um, they're quite cool, aren't they? Yeah, I like well, them. They're not painted up to Alpha Legion yet, but what I'm classing them as is... They're just in disguise. Yeah, the in disguise of Night Lords and stuff. Yeah. Which is always cool. So, two squads of five. Uh, the champion's got plasma, pistol and a fist. Yep. Uh, two chainsaw and bolt pistol, then two plasma guns. Nice, very nice. So, that is the fast attack. Moving on to the heavy support. So, I've got a unit of five Havocs. So, Aspiring champion just got a chainsaw and a flamer. Yes. Because I built some Chosen out of the box. Um, means I only had a flamer left. So yeah, it's I just built them with that. And then I've got two heavy bolters and two Reaper chain cannons again. So, it'll be a lot oh, of fire. There's a lot of Dakar. Yeah, a <laughs> just lot just of Dakar. And then finally, to kick it off. To match your fly, I've got Heldrake as well. Very nice. The Heldrake is such a cool model. Yeah, it's really, really nice model. And I'd give him the auto cannon. Ah, oh. just because I had five points left. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So, so um, I think it's like heavy four, then it's two damage each. That's all right. Yeah, it's quite good against killing marines. But that brings me to 1998. What I will say as well, I've never used another armor before. So if we do get any rules wrong just let us know in the comment section yes it's a massive learning curve for me because yeah i've only played with custodies so it's quite a big difference you're going from using a very very few models to losing a lot more yeah i won't i won't care about losing model which is good yeah but um i'll go over to you with your list yeah so same with me Ox is still new for me it's only my third time yeah. using them so it's gonna be i'm learning new stuff all the time so it's good my clan culture uh, for my battalion is Lucky Blue Gits, so that is yeah. a six up invulnerable, and it means I can reroll one hit and one wound for each unit, except the Gretchen, uh, because they're Gretchen, they don't get it, and also for the Flash Gits, because they're freebooters, so yeah. they're like mercenary pirates, so they don't belong to a clan, so I don't yeah. get it for those. Fair enough. My free HQs, I have a big mech with a custom force field, because I need it. Yeah. He gives a five up. I'm vulnerable in a 9-inch, I believe. I can do a stratagem to expand it to, like, 12 or 18, which is really good. Uh, it's the old wording as well, so it's not just hit the unit and they get it. You've got to be in the bubble, which I oh, assume right, okay, yeah. they're going to change in the new codex because they sort of dabbled in that and then moved away from it well, with, like, the later book. It's weird because AOS was the current rule in the 40k, yeah. but now they're moving to Hurler within. Then yeah. 40k is moving out of it. It's moving away, in it. Yeah. Speaking of weird, it's my weird boy. So... P to CP, so he's yeah. a warp head, so we can do two powers, uh, and he knows warp path and da jump. So warp path is I cast it on a unit and it gives them all plus one attack. Cool. Da jump is I deep strike basically. I yeah. pick him up, move my board, put him down. Oh, is it anywhere? Anywhere, yeah. Which That's is fun random. with orcs because they have the here we go rule, which means when you roll a charge, you roll two d six. Yeah. 
you can re-roll, but you don't have to re-roll both dice. You can re-roll one of them. So if you roll a six and a two, you could keep the six and then re-roll the two. That's so good. She's really, really yeah. good. And then finally, we have Sir Crumpington. He is the biggest boss, so I spent a CP for that. Uh, he has a killer claw, so I've upgraded his claw to the relic claw. And because he's the biggest boss and he's got the killer claw, he's hitting on twos. He's yeah. probably wounding most things on twos, and he's re-rolling hits and wounds. That's so good. It's very good. And in the turn that he, he charges, or is charged, he's claw goes to damage four. That's so good, oh my. It's, what? it's really, really good. So that's him. Oh, he's got a combi shooter that's got a rocket launcher, and yeah. he has an attack squig. Because the attack squig's free. It just gives him an extra two at like, strength yeah. or attacks. So you might as well take it. It costs no points. So then, onto the troops. We have the staple... 30 boys, slugger chopper. Yeah. Then we have 20 boys, slugger chopper. And then we have 20 boys with shooters. Cool. So, yeah. Nice and easy. And then 15 Gretchen. And that's my troops. It's just boys. Just take loads of boys. Just orcs. Just orcs, yeah. yeah. It's just a huge mob. And then in the elites, we have five mega knobs. So they've all got power claws and the uh, custom shooters. They're going to be riding around in the battle wagon, in the bone crusher with the Sacrumpetum. So they're like his loyal... It's like his royal guard, basically. Yeah. And then we have 10 tank busters who are going to be riding around in a truck so they can fire out the truck because it's open topped. Oh, that's cool. So you can like move it around and they can shoot. <laughs> they still get the penalties for moving, but thankfully, rock, most guns in the Orc army are assault because Orcs are always moving. Yeah. So I actually don't get a penalty for firing rockets. Oh, that's cool. Uh, rockets are pretty good as well, but like strength 8, flat 2 damage, like minus 2, it's really good. So they're not yeah. D6 like the Marines. They're either flat 2 or flat 3. So they're really good. And I like taking rockets as orcs because it's hard for orcs to hit. So if I hit something, I want to make sure that I actually kill it. Yeah. So I just take rockets. And they're only like 5 points for a rock. Oh, really? Yeah, the really flamethrower because it auto hits. So it's such a big improvement for orcs. is like yeah. 10 points. That's fair enough. Which is well, well, bonkers to me, but whatever. I don't know why you'd take a flame though because you don't, don't get Daka Daka. No, you don't now. So Daka Daka is like normal. rockets and stuff. It's fun. Yeah. So onto the heavy support, we have the Bone Breaker. So it's like I said earlier on. It's got uh, Sir Crumpington and his Royal Guard in it. So it is armed with four big shooters and a killer cannon, which yeah. is like a just like a it's like strength eight, d six shots, blast. You know, like that sort oh, of thing. Right. It's kind of like a Lehman Ross battle cannon yeah. type job is the best way to describe it. Then I have five flash kits led by a captain. So, flash kits are great. I absolutely love them. They're such cool models, and the guns are amazing, so I really like them. And on the yeah. six, they get to shoot again, so that's fun. Oh, that's good. Then they just do it, so it's fun. And then, a new unit that I've not tried yet, so I don't know how this is going to go, yeah. but I've got five looters. Now, I think normally when you run looters, you want to run at, like, uh, ten. Yeah. But points and me rejigging and stuff... I only took five. These were like a last minute addition, but I think I might do a list where I don't take the. I drop something else, maybe like the Burner Bomber. Uh, except for he's like under 100 points up, and I take 10 looters instead. Yeah. So we looters when you shoot their gun, the D3 shots, but you roll once for the full unit. So if you've got okay. 10 of them, you roll a five or a six, you get three, six, 30 shots. And then last but not least, we have the Burner Bomber, or the Burner Bus, as he's been dubbed. Yeah. Uh, yeah, you know what he does. Can I beat my record of 36 mortal wounds? Probably not, because Tom knows it's coming. Yeah. But, again, I don't always have to blow him up. The threat that I can do it is there. Yeah. And with the new fly rules, I can, like, fly over, drop some bombs, do some shooting, fly off the board, and then come back a turn later, and then yeah. maybe get in a better position and blow myself up. Or maybe never blow myself up. But the option's there. But that is my list. It is... A grand total of 1998 points as well. Oh, so bang on, bang on the same. Yeah. Uh, so we will be back after the mission. So here we go. We have deployed Tom. Would you like to work for your deployment, sir? Certainly. So on the left flank, I've got my normal sorcerer with the raptors, great and clean one, Hellbrew, uh, Heldrake, Havocs just behind that cover. Then I've got Squad of Marines, Squad of Termies, Chaos Lord, term, uh, Marines again, then the big blob of cultists. That is a lot of cultists. We've got like, basically deployed very similar. we got the Battle Lines mission, as you will have seen. So, deployment, we have objective there, objective there, then one over there. And oh, you've... sorry, I forgot to mention. Yeah. Nerglands of um... Cheekily. Deployed there. Deployed as well. onto that. So Tom's got that at the moment. Then there's one here up for grabs. 
my deployment, similar to Tom's, I'm just frontlining because I'm playing Arcs. Speaking of which, yeah. secondaries for me, please. Yes, yeah, so I've took the mission objective. Yes. Um, so two points for middle objectives. Yeah. Then three points for your objective. Um, and then I've got domination, so score more than you, and I get three points. So. And as you said as well, if you're not doing that, you're going to be losing games, yeah, so you might exactly. as well take it. And then I've got thin their ranks because there's a lot of orcs. Yes. So... Uh, should be able to get about, I'm guessing I'll get about 10 points from that. You day. should get a lot from that. Yeah. So I've gone for Deploy Scramblers, because I like to be a little bit cheeky. Yeah. Also gone for Attrition. I feel like probably might be a good one. It's going to be a blood, bloody game. Yeah. So definitely uh, definitely that one. And I've gone for Engage on all fronts, because I'm Orc, so I want to be getting up the yeah. board. And I didn't really go over my deployment too much, but I will pan down the line. So we've got boys... More boys, characters, burner bomber, looters, truck full of tank busters, the bone breaker with Sir Crumpington and his bodyguard, the grots providing a grot shield for the flash kits, and then the other unit of 20 boys on that side. So yeah, we're ready to meet in the middle and it's going to yeah. be carnage. But we'll roll to see who gets first turn. So we'll roll in the middle. First time I'm playing match players. Oh no! Oh, that's the wrong die. <laughs> <laughs> That's staying in the edit. <laughs> I'm Alpha Legion, so I'm, I'm <sighs> used to Apparently, you're chaos. going that way. For, Tom, so you I'm get first turn. turn. So we'll be back after Tom has finished his movement. So into the first turn of Alpha Legion and Nurgle Demons. So I've moved basically most things up. So I've spent a CP on forward operatives, which is a Alpha Legion strat. So I've moved up the... Chaos Cult is 9 inch, so that what, well, and they'll be on that objective. Yep, that is all theirs. I've moved up the Heldrake. Yeah, it's getting spicy. Get, getting your face straight away. I like it. Um, and then I've moved the Termis up and ran the Lord just so you get into the um, reroll ones bubble. And then Great and Clean ones moved up, and all these have moved up as well. So we're going to the psychic phase first. I'll just see if they're in range of smite. No worries, sir. Those poor Gretchen. How could you? So the great and clean one's in range of smite. Yep. The one isn't. So I'll do great and clean one first. Yeah, no worries, dude. So I'll do shrivel pox. I'll just check the range. Yeah, no worries. Just in case it matters. Right, so I've checked the range. It's 18 inch, so I can actually try and do it on the squad of boys. Very nice. So it's a 6 to cast, and it gives a minus 1 toughness. That's really good. Until uh, the end of my psychic phase next turn. That is a fail. That's fine. I didn't, I didn't want it anyway, so... Yeah, yeah it was just like a bonus. You're like, yeah. oh, I am in range, so I'll do it. And then I'll do the uh, smite on... That was Pearl Gretchen. How could you, Tom? That goes, goes off. D3. Two mortal wounds, so, so that'll be two dead. Yes, so I'll remove them. Have you got more yeah. powers and stuff to cast? I have, yeah. So I'll do the Tamer next. So I might as well do the Feel No Pain. Yes. I'll do it on... It's an 18 inch range, actually. Ooh. Who could you catch? I'll do it on the Havocs. Yeah, makes sense. Um, so I need a... Six to cast. That's pretty good. Yep, that goes off. So have the Havocs uh, will have a five up. I do have a deny, but it's 24 inch, and I am all the way over here, oh, so I'm not enough. in range. And then um, this uh, Tammy Sorcerer is going to cast Presessence. Uh, yes. Plus one to hit on the seven plus. Is that one of the Havocs as well? It is, yeah. So it fails. fails. I'm going to use a CP to reroll. No worries, sir. Fails again. Mm. Exactly the same yeah. dice roll. It mm. always happens to me. <laughs> and then I don't think I can do anything else. Okay. Um, because I've got Death Hex on that one, so that's yeah. invulnerable. That Not in range of anything yet. Near in range. And Smite's outside of range, so I believe it's time to move on to shooting. Cool, so uh, we'll let Tom have a think about what he's going to open fire with, and we'll be back in the shooting phase. Indeed. So, as you can probably see, with the amount of dice in my hands, I'm going to fire the Chaos Cultists first into your squad of boys. Yes. So the front line's in rapid fire range, the other ones aren't. 
So I've got 39 shots in total. Oh dear, that's so a lot of dice. These will be hitting on fours, re-rolling ones. That's a really good roll. Then re-rolling these ones. Yes. Oh my god. That is a good roll. Well, so, toughness four, strength three, so five. Five, yeah. So this is the harder bit. Let's see how this goes. Okay, I so can see some fives. Two, three, four, five. That's all right. That's not bad. Cool, so I'll just gather some dice and yeah. then I'll make those saves. I'm in force field range, so I have a five up in vulnerable. I pass two, so I lose three orcs. So I'll just make a little marker. Is anything else going to shoot then this turn? Uh, I'll try to remove them now. I'd remove them now. Um, I've just got a. Have a thing. To shoot, yeah. No worries, dude. Cool, so into the next shooting bit. I'm going to fire. All this at once, because I've just got four plasma guns. I'm going to overcharge. I like it. Living dangerous. Into the truck. That poor truck that's got my tank busters hiding so, inside. Hitting on threes. Give me the ones. Ooh, one that, dead. One dead. And one go through. Oh, with two twos. Then hitting on, uh, wounding on threes. Yes. Strength seven. That goes through. Uh, I will get no armor save. Yeah. But... It's damage two, isn't it? It is, yeah. So on a six, it actually becomes damage one, because ramshackle. Yeah. No. Nearly. But yeah, so the truck takes two wounds, so it's down to eight. Cool. Um, again, I'll probably just figure out all my stats. Yeah, no worries, dude. Right, so on to the next shooting bit. I'm going to use the helm brunt just to shoot everything into the truck. Just to see if I can get him. Yeah. So I'll do the crack missile first, hitting on three. And the Lord's not in range. No. Uh, and then... The Two. last cannon, which is twin. So one. Ooh. What's your toughness? Uh, toughness six. I'm gonna use the CP to re-roll that. That's fair so enough. I'm down to five now. Wow, burning through that CP. Yeah. It still doesn't hit. <laughs> Sod's law, it always happens. Then wounding on the three. Oh no! no. Ah, oh no! It's oh, fine. It's, it's fine. Don't... It's fine. Nobody panic. And then <laughs> I'm going to find a termis into yes. uh, that squad. Is are they the looters? They are, mate. Yeah. So the termi oh. squad firing down here. It's just the front rank, isn't it? Yes. Firing both profiles from the combi uh, plasma down yeah. into my poor looters over there. So I've got six shots with the bolt guns first. Yes. So hitting on fours because both profiles. Yes. That's all right. And what's the toughness of them? Toughness four. So wounded on fours. All five. Right. Three go three. Really, really good. So I've got five ups. Uh, pass one. Fail two. I think I lose two looters. So that's not good for me. That's... Did you take into consideration covers it? Uh, they. It's a five up either way. Ah, fair enough. Because they only have six up armor, I believe. I will double check, but I believe they only have six up armor. Don't to roll the plasma gun as well? Uh, yeah, roll the plasma and then we'll see what yeah. we're left with. Uh, so hitting on through fours even. Two hits, very nice. Then wounded on threes. threes. Just one. Just one, so I've lost two so far. Nope, saves. So I still it. lose two, but I will just check their armor save. Okay. Cool, so into the next shooting. I'm going to use the Havocs uh, to shoot at the truck again. Yes. So uh, I've got six shots with the heavy bolters. Yes, two heavy bolters into the truck. Hitting on freeze. Oh, I should have. I would debate whether to keep the Lord back, but. Yeah, to give the the uh, bubble. Yeah, it's fine now. I'm hitting on fives. Uh, yeah, we're yeah, enough. Oh. Nothing. Never mind. Yeah. Moving on. That's quick. And then the. Hell. Right. Yes, he's going to spit fire down. I don't know whether to use the CP on uh, Demon Forge, which means I can reroll all hits and wounds. Oh, really? Oh, wow, um, that's really good. I'll just have a check whether it's in combat or if it's anything. Not a problem, sir. Cool, so check the rolls. I can use CP on Demon Forge, so I'm going to do it. Yep. Um, so shooting to the truck, so hitting on fours, rerolling everything. Two hits. Nice, full house. Then, wounded on freeze, re rolling. Yes. This could be a good round of shooting. Oh. <laughs> <You're> sorry. <laughs> sorry, Tom. What's his AP? 
Uh, it is AP one minus one minus one. Uh, let me just check the save. So I have two five up saves on the truck. As it's minus one, I pass one, fail one. Is it two damage? It is, yeah. Yes, two damage. So it goes down to six wounds, does the truck. So I'll mark that down in a second. Is yeah. that all of your shooting? Uh, I'm going to use two CP on en Endless Cacophony. Yeah. So I'm going to shoot with the Hellbrute again. That's Just not very see nice. Just kill the truck. That's not very but nice at all. it also means I'm down to two CP. Wow. On turn one. Yeah. Goodness it gracious. Like playing custodies again. Yeah. I thought you were like, oh, it'd be like, it'd be nice to play something yeah. that isn't like custodies. He says down at two CP. So twin last cannon. Yes. Getting on threes. Wounding on a three, I'm guessing. Yeah. But that just true. Uh, no armor save. Uh, do your damage, sir. Four. Four. Ramshackle. Yes, it goes down to one. Uh, oh my. <laughs> <laughs> I'm at it again. So I'm on five wounds because I've not marked it down yet. Yes. Yeah, it's gone down to six. Then I've got the, the crack missile. So you could kill it with the crack missile, to be fair. Hitting on the three. Yeah, it's a hit. Wounding on the three. No. No, is that a one? Ooh, it is. You've already used the CP, so it I lives. <sighs> Ramshackle, boys. It's so good. How, much, how many wounds would you be down to now? Uh, I'd have lost six. I'd have been da I'd have... down to two. I lost... I'd have blown up. No, it was an eight. So I lost... Quick maths. <laughs> Quick maths. I forgot. I'd have been down to like one or two wounds. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Cool. Without uh, um, round shackle. I can do charge phase there. Because Ooh. I've got nothing else to... Who, who's going where? Hellbrute into both trucks. Oh, with a battle wagon and the thing. Interesting. It makes sense, because you're going to stall me. Does your battle wagon do an... Been good if it doesn't charge. Uh, I mean, I still hit on twos. How much damage? How much damage does it do? He's got like six attacks. It's bonkers. Do you want me to quickly double check the stats? Yeah, if you don't mind, <laughs> just okay, so Tom has declared a charge. I have. Uh, into both the trucks. So I'll let you roll the charge, and I'm I gonna anything but a double one. I'm gonna do Is Overwatch it? from the boys in the truck because you're yeah. charging the truck, and the boys are in the truck. So I'm assuming because it's open topped, I can fire. It yeah. Out. It'd just be like shooting normally. Yeah. If we've got it wrong, let us know. But I yeah. can't see why I wouldn't be able to. So I'm going to spend a CP. So just give me a second. I'll gather 10 dice. So here we go. I'm going to fire some Overwatch, which is rockets, into the Hell Drake, which is trying to snack on both my trucks. Sixers. Oh. Holy moly. That's daka daka daka. That's daka daka daka. So that means I roll five more dice, which is the five that I missed. And then I get another hit. That is... Stupid. Uh, what's your toughness? Uh, seven. Wounding on freeze. That is four wounds at minus two, so we demon save. Demon save indeed. Five ups. Uh, you don't pass any, so you take eight wounds. And this is why you don't charge Kyle. <laughs> what's just happened? <laughs> I need a minute. Yeah, it's fine. I need to change the battery, so I'll, I'll give Tom a minute. Right, so because of that monstrosity... <laughs> We're in, the, we're in the combat phase, Tom. So I've got to try and kill that truck in combat. So you, are you hitting the truck? Yeah. Yeah, cool. To be fair, there's no point hitting the battle wagon. No. The, because it's got like 16 wounds, so. So hitting on fours. Nice. Wounded on threes, maybe? Yeah, you should be. Just one. Uh, what's the AP? Uh, I'll roll the dice while you tell me. I'll roll the two, so it's fine, dude. So how much damage? D3. D3. Just one. So the one, so it is down to four wounds, but now I get to fight back. So, my Bone Breaker gets six attacks. Uh, when I use the Death Roller, I hit you on twos. I have no idea how you've managed to swoop down. I'm going to run you over, but it's happening. So hitting on twos. Full house. No daka daka. <laughs> If I was playing Goths, it would get Daka Daka Daka. Really? Yeah, they get Daka 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 in combat. I don't know if the vehicles get it though, but boys get it, which yeah. is pretty cool. So, wounding on freeze. Uh, yeah, four wounds at minus two. So, so it's a bit demon save. Demon save. You need to pass three of these or you die. I've run over. I've run over the flyer. <laughs> 
<laughs> it swooped down to peck at my truck. It's pecked my truck. And then I've revved, like done a wheelie, landed on it, and then I've like grinded it. Does it explode? I don't know. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> I need a minute. Never mind, Tom. <laughs> Is that into your turn? Can someone else come and film? <laughs> Wait, points, points, points before we, we like have a mental breakdown. I don't think I've got anything. You've got domination. You get it end oh, of your turn. Oh dear. Double check. I think it's end of your turn. Um, Let me get the... We'll, we'll be back in a second. We need a minute. So, an interesting turn, Tom. Tom has scored three points. So yeah. you're in the lead. So take from that. But how do you feel it went as a turn? Awful. <laughs> 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 I, I actually thought I could have held you back, like, yeah. for a turn. Yeah, um, stole me. I've just but... wasted 160 points. I've managed to run over a flyer with a giant roller with well, spikes on it. So it's mental. The, it would have worked if yeah. it didn't roll so well. On the Overwatch. Roll. Yeah. However, on the objective side of you, I've got both middle objectives. Yes, yeah. I've got to get you off them. And I've got a huge force yeah. to back. You're in a good spot. Yeah. Like, you, you are in a good spot. You are in the lead, and you're in a good spot board control-wise. Yeah. So it's how I counter counter-attack you now and see how it goes. Yeah. But we did forget the Demon Prince. So do you want to roll his powers, Tom? Yeah. It's out of sequence. We forgot to do it, so we're going to do it live. So just roll it here for me, sir. So I roll 2d6, and it's just random stats instead of picking one. A two and a three. Okay, so... One of them's revoltingly resilient, so add one to disgustingly resilient rolls. Very nice. So four up to ignore That's ones. really good. Then avalanche of rotten flesh, so plus one to charge rolls. Nice. In addition, this model's crushing bulk inflicts D3 mortal wounds on two plus. Is that the, when you charge? Yes. Ah, so I don't so, want to get charged by him. Interesting. That's all right. That's was, not bad. I was hoping for 11 plagues, which were four, which is double hits on... Um, attacks that's double the strength, but Ooh. here's where it is. It's still quite good. I didn't want the six because that will minus one leadership. Which is pointless against yeah. Darks because I've got mob rule. Do you have to do a leadership on the Gretchen? Uh, they lost three Gretchen. Uh, I will double check, yeah. and if I need to do it, we'll do it quickly off camera and let know people know what happens. But we'll be back <laughs> at the end of Orcs turn one. I, I just don't know what to do. <laughs> And on that bombshell, we'll be right back. So here we go. It is Revenge of the Greenskins. So the Burner Bomber has flown in to Tom's firebase. So originally I was going to go that way, but then I realised if I fly over the Termies, I'm going to drop bombs on the Termies, which is seven dice, spend a CP so it spreads to the Havocs, then big red button, do a flying headbutt, and then I'm going to get everyone into loads of mortal wounds. Over here, with uh, move forward with the shooters and these orcs. I'm going to try and dive on the cultists, shoot them up a bit, dive on them, beat them up, see what happens. Over here, the war boss, Sir Crumpington, and his royal guard. So they've come out of the bone breaker. I move them, then I've advanced them because I've got the wag ability with the war boss, which means that they can charge after advancing, which is why I've moved and advanced these boys as well. So I'm going to smash into here and hopefully wipe this out and these Gretchen out. Uh, not Gretchen. It's because they're green and they're tiny. The Nurglings, and then hopefully take this objective off Tom. The Bone Breakers just shot up the middle. The Rocket boys, the Tank Busters, and the Looters have stayed still. And that's it. But now, let's do some burning. So, we're going to drop bombs on the Terminators. The Terminators are two wounds each. Yes. So, seven dice. On a, every four up, you take a mortal wound. So, that's fine. You lose a Terminator. Cool. So you've lost one Terminator, and then I spent a CP so the fire spreads. Yeah. Or two CP, I'll double check it. Uh, so there's five Havocs, so they're within six inch. Uh, wow, you lose three Havocs. It's on a but I've got a five up feel. Five up feel no pain, yeah. Because of the... So if I'd have bombed the Havocs initially, they'd have died. Oh, so you do lose three Havocs. So I'll get rid of... That one, that one. What's um, the range of your... Six inch. Havocs are going to die. And then... So you've lost the Termi as well. And then... Yeah, yeah they're in range. So I'm going to big red button. So I'm going to spend a CP. And we'll take the camera off Tom. And uh, Well, Tom, you can remove the casualties and then we'll film the aftermath. So it is time for the looters over here to fire into what's left of the Terminators. Tom lost two Termis. One is injured. If we look at the big hole actually left 
by the Burner Bomber. They're down to two men. That Chaos Squad's down to two men. The Havocs are down to one. He passed two of his five ups. Yeah. So you've got Havoc left, which is good. So, it, you know, he's still going. Silver lining. Before <laughs> so, you shoot, go I'm on. going to use my last two CP, I believe. Oh, my goodness. Uh, I'll just grab the strap now. No worries, sir. So I'm going to use CP call Conceal. Yes. So select one Alpha Legion infantry from your army. Until the end of that phase, enemy models can only target that unit if it's the closest visible. Okay, so I'm shooting... So that'll be on the Terminators. So that's on the Terminators. So the closest visible uh, would be the Terminators. Oh wait, no it wouldn't, because you've got the... Is it just Alpha Legion or is it anyone? It just says enemy models can only target that unit if it's the closest visible. Right, so yeah, I can't shoot the Terminators because we've got the uh, Nerglings and the other stuff. Okay, that's... Hmm, that's frustrating. I'm gonna, it might be a bit of a waste, but then because of that, I'm gonna put the looters into the last havoc. Yeah. So what I do is I roll a d3, and that's how many shots all their guns get. So they get three because it's me, obviously. <laughs> so that's nine shots. So these hitting on fives, yeah. we get daka daka daka. Uh, we get hits, so, and then a daka daka daka. Which does not convert. It's strength seven, your toughness five, so it's freeze. So that is. Oh! I'll re roll one of my hits, sorry, because yep. I'm lucky blue gits, which doesn't do it. And then that failed wound I'll re roll, which wounds. That is three at minus two. So it'll be a four up. A four up, yes, because you are behind the wall. That's. Uh, you take six wounds, sir. That's... Right, I'll just roll this because I've got. Oh, yeah, you've got feel no pains. Yeah, uh, he's dead. Yeah, he's dead. That's good for me, the Havocs are wiped off the face of the earth. So if you give me a moment, I need to pick a target. Do you know what? I need to gather loads of dice, because I'll do the easy one first, I think. So give me a second. So the shooters over here, they're going to fire into the cultists. So they are assault two. So it's 40 shots, because there's 20 of them. I'm hitting on fives, and obviously six says daka daka daka. So, let me remove all the misses, and then we'll think about daka daka dakas. So that was a six. Which Whilst Kyle's doing that as well, we did roll um, leadership on morale on Gretchen. We did. Four more. No. Yeah, four more. Four more Gretchen wrong. fled. Yeah, so actually shooting them worked out quite all right. So out of that, I've got four, eight, 11, 11 hits, and then another five on top, which are daka daka daka. So I'll roll five more dice, which gets me another hit. I get to re-roll one dice because I'm lucky blue gets. That's against a daka daka daka, which doesn't Can hit. You re-roll a re-roll. Uh, it wasn't a re-roll for a re-roll. Uh, it yeah. generates the extra hit because a daka daka daka. So then strength four, toughness three. I'm guessing toughness three. Yeah. Freeze, and I get to re-roll a failed one, which converts. So that is two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven saves. Right, I'll go and grab my dice. Cool. So I've got eleven six up saves to do. Uh, uh, just the one. Just the one, so you lose ten. Yes, yeah, so I'll remove them, and then we'll go and see next shooting bits. Yes. The tank busters, I should have actually moved it up. I forgot that they're uh, assault weapons. I could have moved them up closer so they wouldn't have been a penalty. So I'm going to have to shoot at the Nurglings, which sounds mad, but I need to remove them off this objective because they are objective secured. So I need to get that swinging in my favour. Hitting on fives! Okay, so we've only got four hits. But I re-roll one for Lucky Blue Gits, which does not convert. And then I've got a Daka Daka Daka, which doesn't get me anything. So then this is wounding. Are you toughness four? Uh, I'll just have a quick check for you. I will roll while Tom is having a look. So I hope you're toughness four, because then that means I wound with everything. I won't be above toughness four, I don't think. You won't be toughness five, you don't think? No. Uh, let's have a cheeky look. Toughness two. <laughs> oh, OK. So four saves, Tom. Each one you fail is flat free damage. So that's one on your demon. Two on your demon. So that's just one base dead. One base, yeah. So one base goes down. And the spare damage is wasted. So one base is removed, damage is wasted. The truck has a big shooter. I'll just shoot into the Nurglings. What is wrong with me? Daka daka daka. It's then a hit. Re roll. And re roll, because lucky blue gets. Full house. And re-roll, because daka 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 as well. Yeah, thank you, Tom. So, no. you've just hit four times out of five. If out of three shots. 
Four, four hits out of three, three, three rounds being fired. Wounded you three times because of your toughness two, so demon saves. What damage is it? Uh, one damage because it's a big shooter. So it'll be five ups followed by five ups. Oh, okay. Uh, one go, uh, two goes through, sorry, then five up feel no pain. So one goes Just through. One damage. So a base takes a wound, so that's not the best. I have got my death roller there, so my death roller can shoot. The Gretchen over here, they're going to shoot into... Uh, the Nerdlings, I'm just trying to plink away, so hitting on fours. Uh, did they get Daka Daka Daka? Because they don't get... I think um, they do, but they don't get clan culture. So I don't get Lucky Blue Gits. Gretchen, do get Daka Daka Daka. Cool. So I get to... Uh, nope, doesn't matter. Strength two on the Grot, on the grot Blasters. So fours. <laughs> two wounds! Oh, oh dude. Bloody Gretchen. Battle of the Grots and... Oh, it's ridiculous. Uh, five ups. No, and then... Five ups. They've actually done... They did more wounds than the big shooter. Amazing. Is that another base gone or? Uh, Just one one left. Ace. So, the war boss. So, Grumpington, he's got the combi rocket. He's going to fire it into the Gretchen. So, I'm going to shoot the shooter part first. Yeah, I was just about to say that, it. yeah. So, the two shooter shots hitting on... Uh, so he's ballistic skill five, because obviously, you know, so sixes. So that's a daka daka daka. I get lucky blue git, so I'll reroll that. No, but then I've got a daka daka daka. Would you look at that? <laughs> Moving on, twos. Uh, lucky blue git, so I get to reroll. Yep, two wounds. I'm trying to get rid of that last wound. You've got it. So that last, that nurgling base on one wound is removed. So now I can fire the rocket. So before you remove that, I'll fire the rocket. Yeah. So hit it on a six. Uh, no one I've used my lucky blue gits. Cool. Uh, so yeah, I'll let you remove your bases while I just figure out the rest of the uh, mega knobs. So over here, the mega knobs are gonna carry on into the nurgling base. So custom shooters, assault four, hitting on sixes, um, cause they're orcs and they can't aim. So sixes. Two hit, which is good because I get daka daka daka. I've only got two. That's very unlike you. So I'll reroll that. Oh dear. Uh, and then I'll do the two daka daka dakas. Yeah, so only two. They're too busy running forward, getting ready for a good crumping. Uh, I've wounded you twice. So five up demon saves. None. Do you want to do the damage or is it? It's just one damage, sir. Ah, uh, five up feel no pain then. That's a base down to one wound. Nice! So we're slowly chipping away, and now I have to figure out what I'm going to shoot my flash gits at. Here we go. The flash gits are going to fire all their guns into the undamaged raptor squad at the back. So I've just got to get 15 dice. So just bear with me a second. I just need another three. So these are actually hitting on fours. Oh, really? Because they're the flashiest arcs around. So there's no lucky blue gits, yeah. but they get daka daka daka. Okay. So hitting on pots. So I've dropped quite a few. There's no daka daka dakas. I think that's the first for you. So this is strength six. It is actually. I normally roll really well with these. So that is uh, five wounds. These are minus two. So it'll be four up because I've got cover. Yes, and then two damage, but obviously one damage marine, so four saves, sir. I'll just roll two dice twice. Not a problem. Oh, look at that. Just one nice. dice. Just one marine falls. Very nice, sir. Uh, you remove that, and I'll think about where my bone breaker's going to shoot. So the battle wagon is going to fire bit, four big shooters into this chaos squad here. And then it's going to put its kill cannon straight into the hell brute. So I'll just, just roll it here. Uh, sorry, do you want to just measure whether it's outside of 12 for we the... For the people at home, let us have a look. So they are within 12 and they are... It's not like measure 12. from the hollow anything, is it? Uh, no, just measure from the from the model. We'll just oh, do yeah. it here because we don't yeah. need the dice tray anymore. So big shooters, hitting on fives. I'm going to save my lucky blue gits for the kill cannon. Yeah. I've got two daka daka dakas, which gets me two that more hits. Is... You on... need to stop playing orcs. Ah, it's so good. And we're on freeze. Ooh. Two, four, six. 
Seven wounds! Ten they rend? No, sir. So seven Do I get ups. cover from that? Uh, no, because you're not behind the wall. Seven, did you say? Yes. I'll roll these four. That's a good of roll. Of course. You've lost one. How many? Was it was seven. seven, yes. Oh, the squad. So the squad is removed. So there's a nice big hole there. So what we're going to do is I'm going to fire the kill cannon. So D6 shots. Six, of Ob course. Obviously. Uh, hitting on. Fives. Oh. That happened. Oh. That did happen. Yeah. I can roll bad, you see. It can, it can happen. It's I think it's one to about five games. It is, yeah. So, that's all the shooting. So, so far, there's a really good shooting face for me. Do you know what we didn't do? Didn't do sidekicks. I'm going to do that really quickly. Uh, I thought you were going to say roll five ups. No, I'm going to put Warpath on the big 30 uh, Orc Boy squad over here. Yeah. So, uh, what is that? Eight. That's an eight that goes off, so they all get plus one attack. I'm not going to do jump anything, because I would have done that already, so I can't. It was just Warpath I forgot to do. So, we'll be back in the Orc Charge phase. On to the Orc Charge phase. So, over here. I need a seven. These 30 boys are going to go slamming into these cultists. So we need a seven. I do have, here we go, so I can re-roll if needed. Probably going to, uh, literally, that dice that didn't make it in the dice tray was a five. I am so upset. Doesn't matter, it's a nine. What is wrong with me? Do you want to re-roll the three? What? I couldn't fail anyway, because yeah, I needed a seven. You might so it doesn't well. matter. I'll leave it. Fair enough. Because then I get more in, because nine's a good number. Yeah. Uh, so then they're going to move in. So that's these boys over here. So we'll move on to the next thing, which is this 20 boy squad here. They're charging both units of raptors. So I'm just gonna roll here. I just need a high number as possible. An eight, that's really good. So I'll keep that next to them. Uh, they had a nine, so I'll keep that next to them. The mega knobs are gonna go into the front squad of raptors. Yeah. That's a nine. And then I'm um and hour in about Sir Crumpington. I, I, I feel like this game's going to be ended next turn. So Shall I go into the I'd, great unclean one? You might as well. So if we look over here, so Crumpington's pointing. I'm going to call him out. I'm going to go into the great unclean one. I need a ten. I'm keeping that five. Come on now. Oh. The one time you don't roll a five I up. know. I actually wanted him to go in. <laughs> I'm going to spend... Uh, I'm gonna, I don't know if it's two or... One CP, but I'm going to do ramming speed on the Bone Crusher. Okay. 3d6, keep the highest, into the Hellbrute. So he's going to ramming speed into the Hellbrute. Oh, and the Sorcerer. It's about an, probably a 10 inch charge into Sorcerer. I'm going to CP that. Let's measure, because that's a 9. Yeah. Ooh, that's close. 9 would get me within half an inch. Ah, cool. Cool. Well, not cool, but you know. And then I'll see what the mortal wound is yeah. for running speed and knock my CP down. That's all my charges, so we'll move everything in and we'll be back in the fight phase. So over here, the 30 orc blob have made it into the poor cultists. <laughs> uh, they have warpath on them, so that's four attacks each because there's more than 20 of them. So that's 120 attacks. Nice. So we're doing 40 at a time. So here we go, hitting on freeze and then wounding on freeze. Oh, only if I was playing goths and I got daka 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 on combat. I don't, I've dropped six. Wow. To be fair, that's quite that's, average, isn't it? That's really, really good. Uh, wounding on freeze. So let's remove any that have failed. Okay, so we've got. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24 wounds from the first 40. That is crazy. Right, so I've got 22 dice and there's 20 quarters left. Here I we go. I basically need 22 six ups. <laughs> You've got two. No, four. 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 You got four. Um, I'm. Not going to be like salt in this way, but I am going to remove them just I to save I do have Kyle. 80 attacks left. Yeah. And I can spend 2 CP to fight again. Yeah. So. so. Yeah, we'll, we'll remove the cultists. So I'll let, I'll let Tom do that. And then we'll go over to the other side of the board and continue the scrapping. 
So over here in this massive mess that we've got, the Mega Knobs are going to fight the front Raptor squad that they charged in. There's four Raptors left. So there's 15 attacks from the Mega Knobs. Hitting on force because they've got power claws. So the minus one. And then obviously I have Lucky Blue Gits. So that gets... Oh, no, it doesn't. And then I'm double strength, so I'm wounding on twos. And I'll re-roll the wound because of Lucky Blue Gits. So that's two. For six, do you want me to tell you the AP of a power claw? Because I have forgotten. I'm guessing it'll be minus three if it's like a claw or something. I would assume so, yeah. I'll roll my dice. Yeah, you roll the dice. It is minus three. The squad is white. Nice. So four raptors are snipped. So Tom's reading those. And then we'll be back in a second after I've piled the 20 orc boys into the second raptor squad. So over into the mess because I wiped out. The uh, Raptor squad at the front, I've piled in with the Orcs because they charged both Raptor squads, which is key, so I picked my targets carefully to clear out the front Raptor squad so I could pile into the one behind. 57 attacks. Only one Orc didn't make it, which I'm sure you could like. That Orc's me. <laughs> stood around wondering what is happening, hitting on freeze. I wish I had Daka 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 in combat. I say this every time. That's a really good roll. Do orcs even need a new codex? <laughs> yes. Yes, they do. I, it's gone, like... What is that roll? It's gone so... Oh, there's a miss there. It's gone so well, I don't even understand. So yeah, this... It's weird, isn't it? Is on fours. Yeah, I did not expect it to go this well. It's mad. So on fours... Uh, I'll re-roll one of my misses, by the way. So that hits. So that's an extra wound I can roll, which failed, so I'll re-roll it with my Lucky Blue Gips. There we go. Uh, let's pick out the, the failed wounds. Okay, so we have 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 22, 24. Free up, sir, if you would. What did I roll last time? 22? I'll roll these dice first. Yeah, I'll, that's fair. Any rend? No rend, because choppers don't have rend, sadly. Uh, you failed four. four. And there's one there's one guy left then? Uh, there's only four. Yeah. Because so the plasma gun died. So they're dead. There, yeah. That, I, I don't know. That's the thing that happened. I don't understand. Oh, also, for the battering ram, for the ramming speed, for the battle wagon, I, I rolled a one. We did it off camera, so I didn't yeah. win the sorcerer amount of wounds. Because it were off, off camera. Yes, that's literally it. But now, I'll let Tom remove his raptors and I'll get ready to do my battle wagon. So over here, the bow breaker has smashed into the hell brute and the sorcerer. He gets an extra d6 attacks. Okay. I'm going to spend a CP. Four. <laughs> so that's seven. So I'll add... Uh, hang on. Seven attacks. So these hitting on twos. I'm just going to put them all into the sorcerer. Yeah, might as well. Uh, yeah, that's full house. Strength nine. So two. Threes. What time uh, are you? I'm, might be five with Terminator. Ooh, I'm going to re-roll that with Lucky Blue Gates. I roll these five first. Yeah. And just then... in case. Then we'll check. Do you get it? You don't have an invulnerable, do you? Oh, you Terminator, so you don't have an invulnerable. Five up. Five up, yeah. So you pass two, but you take six wounds. Is dead. Oh. <laughs> yeah, so me and Tom had a discussion before I rolled that, and I think we're gonna go to the wrap-up. Yeah. This is probably this is literally the quickest game I've ever played in my life. I, I feel sad. <laughs> I feel bad. <laughs> I'm a bad, bad orc. But we'll be back in a second. So here we are, we're in the wrap-up. Where is it? I, I don't even know what to say. I did not expect it to go like that at all. I said to Tom, before game, it will be a quick game, but I thought because it'd be a mess in the middle yeah. and we'd both hammer each other and it would be over by turn two. I have never I have never played a game of 40k, never, that's been over after one turn. I don't understand what happened. Well, we do. Because yeah. if Tom, if the Chaos Space Marines have two wounds... Tom loses nowhere near as much from the Flying Headbutt. I cannot see Flying Headbutt being in the new Art Codex. It's very powerful. It's so good. I get why it's 1 CP, because 
the other stratagems that allow your vehicles to blow up are also 1 CP, so it's in line yeah. with all the other ones, but the issue is, is that the Burner Bomber does flat free damage to everyone. Yeah. And it's in 6 inch, it's flat free damage to everyone, You don't, like, there's no randomness, and it's so mobile because it's a plane. Yeah. So you do your bombs, which is already mortal wounds, then you explode, and I just, yeah, I did, I, ugh. I don't like. I don't know what to say because I don't like a game to go like that. Yeah. Because I want a fun, like a fun game for both of us. And I, yeah, I don't. I, know. I don't. I've, I've got no words. Like I'm I, struggling. I, I, <laughs> I keep telling myself, "Oh, you're bad at playing 40k," but I'll, no, like it's no, you're not. That's I, the thing. I just don't know what I could have done. Well, I know what I could have done. With, like, I could have spread, spread them out a bit more. But even so. Even if and it's stop. still got something. Yeah. And it's still got something. The next time we play, I'm not... Especially if you're using, like... We'll do it again and use Marines, and I won't use the Burner Bomber. I'll use something else. Because against one wound stuff, it's it's just yeah. so strong. I took it because I thought, oh, we're both still non-codex. Like, I'll, I'll keep it. it. It should do okay. Yeah. But it just completely ruined your firebase. Well... Your firebase was gone. You had no Havocs left or yeah. anything. My, my shooting phase was terrible as well. Yeah, like, what didn't help is that I didn't realise the range of your Havocs. If you'd have moved... Because it's 24 inch, isn't it? Yeah. So if you'd have moved them up... Yeah. They could have got around to shoot because we're only 24 inch apart. So if they'd have moved up, you could have shot with them. So that's a load of Daki you didn't get. Because I thought when you got first turn, I thought I was in serious trouble. Uh, to be fair, like, I thought... I could have had a great turn. I thought you were going to step forward with Avex and I, just chain gun everything. Yeah. Well, to be fair, that's my bad for yeah. not checking. I I also didn't think to say to you, oh, the big the Ronnie Twenty Four. Yeah. Because I don't I've never played Chaos. I've never I haven't played against them. And I haven't played as them. Yeah. Like with the chain gun. Sorry, I played against them before, obviously. But... Well, the other reason I didn't want to move them up is because I had that CP for. Um, you can't target. Yeah, it if it's that, yeah. Um, but it's just crazy how underpowered they are. This this sounds salty in a way, but I'm not trying to be. Because yeah. you roll so well. Yeah. Orcs is a perfect army for you. I, this is the thing. I kept saying every time I played a game, I should play Orcs. Yeah. It's literally the perfect for me. It's like, oh, you can roll really well because they're normally terrible at shooting. Have a bonus for it. Yeah. Can you imagine if they changed Daka Daka in the new codex so that it's like Tesla? Yeah, that'd be crazy. that I don't have to re-roll to. I don't just roll to hit. It's just an auto hit. I'd be bonkers. Yeah. But yeah, that it was a weird game. Like I, I still enjoyed it. Yeah. Because I still I just enjoyed playing forty k. But I I feel a little bit bad when <laughs> I feel, like when it goes so one sided. Yeah. Like it's weird because this is what happened to me against Sam and oh, the Necrons. That? I got absolutely rinsed. Yeah. And I was like, oh, don't worry about it. I still really enjoyed it. Yeah. And then it's gone the other way, and I'm like, ah! So, Do you want that? If I, if you want my honest opinion, yeah. I didn't enjoy it too much. Yeah. Just for the fact I didn't get to try out my units. Yeah. But that's what I mean. That that's thing, it's a dice game, so. Yeah. Like, my dice rolls were subpar. Yeah. The first turn. Uh, well, it's just say the first turn. It's me. I think you just. I joked after the Death Guard game when you were yeah. like, could I do anything wrong? I said, not play me? Yeah. Because I'm obnoxious for some reason. Yeah, we're going to try it again in the future and there'll be no Burner Bomber. I, I think my army could have done better against Blood Angels. Yeah. That is crazy. Yeah, yeah, that, that would have lasted longer. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's proper frazzled my brain. But if you've got any tips for Tom... Let him know, because yeah, obviously I'm, Tom's still learning. I've, I've been playing a long time. Yeah. Um, I'm not going to use the Berman the Bomber next time against Tom, because that was bonkers. I used it against Sam, and it is, obviously it did 36 more wounds, but I got rinsed, so it didn't matter. And yeah. that's what I expected. I expected that, you know, you've got power armor, you've well, got loads of bolters, I'm just going to get rinsed off board, but it just did it. Do you know in other games, is it usually 18 inch away for... Yeah, uh, it's normally 24, like this one. Yeah. Normally, deployments are always 24 apart, unless it's the weird circle in the middle of yeah. the board. Normally, you're 24. So, I, that's what I mean. I expected the Havocs to be, like, right on the edge. You got first turn, I was like, oh, God, he's going to step up, and he's just going to absolutely rinse me. Yeah. We're like... You had, like, how many Reapers? 
the Gatlings. Four. But then uh, two in Havocs, then one in oh, each. Geez. Oh god, see that's a lot of shots. So nearly 80 shots we're looking at, probably. They're only heavy eight. Did you have ten? Oh, four in re four in re no, no, I have two in Havocs. Two in Havocs, then one in each. One in each, do you have three? Four? Yeah, so that's still 36 shots. That's still a lot of shots, hitting on threes, you'd be winning on threes. Yeah. I get no save. That's still a lot of Daka. You could have put a dint in in either any of the boys. To be fair though, I'm surprised the truck survived. Because the truck literally the truck only survived because I rolled the six with the ram shot. Not even that though, it you would have been down to two wounds. Yeah, it would have been. So I put in put in six shots with heavy bottler. Fired yeah. twice with heavy uh, with the Hellbrew. I fired yeah, with the did. Heldrick. Yeah, you Oh god, yeah, you're shooting with it. Now that I'm thinking about it again, because it's all a blur. Like, yeah. we've only played one turn, but it's a blur. Yeah. That, yeah, that. But I don't know whether that's because I put my Lord out of range for so real one. Yeah, you lost the, re the. Even if we're all twos, it's. I thought the cultists would have done more against the the orc, the chopper boys as well. Yeah. You only killed a few. Yeah, but her. Few. I suppose it's because she's. Fours and fives, isn't it? Fours and fives, yeah. That's true. What a bizarre game. Yeah. I, I really... I, I don't think I need help playing the game. I just need to know what re went wrong in this game, if anything. Yeah. Because it's hard... Because I came from Custodies and... Yeah, yeah. I, I'm proper bad at playing Custodies because I worry about units too much. I use too many rerolls and my rerolls turn into fails. It's, yeah. It's weird. Funnily um, enough, we weren't going to do Orcs Chaos. We yeah. were going to do... Tom was going to use my Blood Angels, and I was going to use Death Guard. Yeah. So then Tom would ha have a go at a really strong codex. So I think we need to do that. I think you need to give yourself a go. Bit of a, um, a prep talk. Yeah, yeah. Get get the Blood Angels on the table. Get yeah. my Blood Angels on the table. Sam's got those Blood Angels as well, and we'll we'll get you playing Blood Angels, and you can have a go yeah. with... So then, when you play when you play Blood Angels, or you play the Death Guard, or you use Sam's Necrons, you can see the difference because it's really easy for me to say I can see the the difference. Yeah, and you can say that as well when you played against it. But until you actually play it yourself yeah. and you see what it can do, that's when you're like, I can see how powerful these yeah. new codexes are. But yeah, that was an interesting game. Yeah, the, let us know anything to help Tom. In the comment section, other than Kyle, don't bring the burner bus because I won't bring the burner bus next time against Tom. That was horrible. I did say I didn't enjoy the game, but I still enjoyed the game. Yeah. It just. It's a shame you didn't get to use your yeah. use your units, which is like, which is the great. Clean one didn't even do anything. <laughs> no, he didn't. Bless him. I said pre-game. I'm just ignoring him. Yeah. I I tried to charge the Crumpington into him because there is like a ten percent chance I could have killed him in yeah. one turn, which would have been hilarious. I wouldn't have done it because you've got your demon save and you fall and feel no pain. But you never know. Yeah. But anyway, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you guys in the future for more tabletop videos.